All right, now we're going to do a geometry problem and we're going to use systems of equations in order to do this one also. But before we start it, let's kind of get some ideas about what we're talking about here. It says the perimeter of a rectangle is 120 meters. Well, let's think about what a rectangle looks like. A rectangle, of course, something like this, and generally in our rectangles we have one side that we call the length and another side that we're going to call the width. So this is like identifying our variables. Now they told us that the perimeter is 120 meters. Okay, and let's think about what we know about the perimeter of a rectangle. Isn't it true that the perimeter formula is twice the length plus twice the width? Remember, for perimeter, we just add up all of the sides. So we would have a length and another length, or two lengths, a width and another width, which is two widths. This is telling us our first equation in our system. Um, in our system, we would have two lengths plus two widths would equal the perimeter, which they told us was 120 meters. Now the next sentence says if the length of the rectangle is, remember what the word is means when we translated English into mathematical statements? This would be the same thing as writing L equals. The length is 20 meters more than. More than was a key word for addition. So this is 20 more than or 20 plus the width. And then it says, what are the dimensions of the rectangle? So they're asking us for length and width. These are our systems of equations. And actually, this one is set up very nicely to do um, substitution method because we already have one of the equations that is solved for a variable. So here we have the length is actually 20 plus w. So I can plug that in place of the length in the first equation. So now we can say twice instead of L, we can use 20 plus W because that's what L is. Plus 2W equals 120. And now we can distribute and solve. So 40 plus 2W plus 2W equals 120. We add like terms, we'd get 40 plus 4W equals 120. If we subtract 40 from both sides, we get 4w equals 120 minus 40 would be 80. And then dividing both sides by 4, we would get w equals 20. So that tells us that the width is 20 meters. Now we still have to find the length. But we know, because of this equation up here, that the length is 20 plus the width which we already found to be 20 meters. So that tells us then that the length is 40 meters. And this is how we used um, systems of equations in order to solve geometry problems.